Hi guys, so as you have heard about DeepSeek R1 model that is released recently and you can see in the website they are saying it is now live and open source rivaling OpenAI model 01. Now why DeepSeek is so famous and why it is in the news? Basically it has tumbled the stock market of USA, it has reduced the share of Nvidia. So everywhere there is a lot of noise around DeepSeek but why it is so famous? The main reason around it is its cost and how cheap it is now to use the LLM models. Now, if you're not sure what are LLM models, they are large language models. ChatGBT is one of the most successful LLM model that is being consumed by most of the AI tools you might see. So a lot of AI tools are in the market. You must have seen a lot of videos in my channel around AI tools and they use some of the LLM models. Now what DeepSeek did, it created its own LLM model, which is much cheaper. It is not using that much of the energy. All these things uses energy. And if you see and review the pricing, it is lot cheaper. So you might see in future, you will see a lot of AI tools available at a lot low cost as ChatGPT used to charge a lot high. Now in this video, let me go through what deep seek is how to use it how to log in and what are the variations around deep seek so it's a detailed tutorial around deep seek what are the pricing models how you can use this llm model into your own ai tools and how you can use it to make money online as well as you can see in the screen you deepseek.com is the website you have to go with the official website a lot of fake websites are getting created as well so make sure you are aware like you need to go to deepseek.com okay there are three ways you can use deepseek either through web or app and api as well web is easiest one click on start now it will ask for a login you can log in using your gmail or you can create your own uh, email id and then put a password you can see a message due to a large scale malicious attack on deepseek services registration may be busy I tried it, it took me five minutes to register it. So it's really getting very busy and it is getting a lot of malicious attacks as well. Second option is you can use it in your phone by scanning the QR code. You can just see, I just hovered it and a QR code is generated. So you can just scan it and install it in your mobile phone. The third way is the API platform. Now this is where the interesting bit comes in. If you see, if you click on the API, you will see the pricing and deep seek chat content length 64 K max out to 8 K and the price of 1 million tokens input price is 0 0.014 dollars. However, if you compare with chat GBT, chat GBT is charging 2.50 per 1 million dollar. Now, if you calculate it, so it is 178 times cheaper than what chat gbt is charging us so you can see the reason why it is so famous and this is the main reason why deep seek is being now one of the main competitors for chat gbt it has a lot of potential reviews around deep seek is quite good so let's test deep seek so you can see the interface looks similar you can create a new chat and in the new chat you will see the search and the deep seek think r1 which is the latest model that has been launched in there is an attachment button as well so you can attach some files as well the beauty is that it is in the free version itself it has all the capabilities that chat gbt 4.0 has in its paid version so i have the paid version of chat gbt 4.0 and i am now having the free version for deep seek so if i say to deep seek uh, say in the search panel say I want to bu buy a bike so best bike in UK okay let's search let's see how the results look like it has said found 32 results so you know chat GBT has a affiliation with uh, Bing and it mainly gives the Bing result now the result of uh, deep seek is quite innovative so we'll use the same prompt for chat gbt in their search feature and let's see what it comes out with 
and I will be using the paid version of ChatGPT. I will be using the free version of ChatGPT as well. This is my free version. I will click on search. Let's see what it comes with. Now ChatGPT has given me the sources in the free version. Okay. Now let's go to the paid version. Now the paid version is also similar. Now what interesting bit is we need to compare all these results. And if I see deep seek it has said i have provided 32 results it has found it okay it has the links as well from where it has done so it has done two links okay and they are kind of latest i did a research on chat gbt it is mostly what bing results so it just rewrites that bit but uh, deep seek is doing everywhere so deep seek is looking after google search results as well and this is one of the advantage on deep seek where it is able to provide some of the exact results around what we are looking for you can try other queries as well and then if you want to say write a code around or you want to create an app say i want to create an app to play tick tack to game let's see what deep seek does okay the user wants to create a tic-tac-toe i have written a wrong spelling it understood firstly decide the platform testing edge cases everything it has written it has given the kind of a design it has written the html for me so this is much more complex queries in a very simple layman human terms i have given it and this model is giving me all the codes it is giving me an option to run the html as well so let us see how it works so i'll click on run html and you can see there is an output okay let's see if it gives me the right result yeah reset game oh my god I never thought I can play tic-tac-toe so easily. I'll close this one. I will use the same prompt in chat GBT, both free and paid version. Let's try first with the free one. I've put the prompt, create an app to play tic-tac-toe. Okay, let's see. So it is writing a Python code. Now, I have to install Python, run the script and do all these things. Okay. So I have to do a lot more work if I am a developer and if I am not a developer, I don't know anything about it. I can just do it in deep seek. It creates the game in a second and it allows me to play as well, which is awesome. Now the, let me try the same bit in my paid 4.0 version. So in the paid version, you can preview, which is what I am doing in the free version of DeepSeek. Okay. So it has given me a code level kind of a console, which is quite good in chat GBT, which is not the case in DeepSeek. But yeah, I have to pay $20 per month for this one. And let's see whether the app runs correctly or not. Okay. The code is done. So let me preview it. So it has not given any winners. That's okay. So winner is X, but how? It is not giving me that green color bar, which deep seek has given me, which is, which is something I have to write it again. So I have to say that winner needs to be highlighted in green okay now let me see if it does it or not okay now it has updated so let me see it now it is working but it is not blinking so th there are bits in chat gbt where you have to ask it to perform everything but i have I've started using DeepSeek and uh, 
you will like the interface you will like everything around it see it, it's quite cool and it is free so i have started using deep seek if you also want to learn around prompts and how to use it you can go to our website deepavali seo tips i have written a lot of prompts around deep seek as well now which we have started to review it and the best part is deep seek is an open source code so what does an open source code means that it it's all the data everything is available so it's an open source you can extract that model and you can use it for your own purpose customize it they have their apis which is quite cheap now you will see lot of uh, companies will be starting to use deep seek as their uh, as their preferred ai tool and this will help in reducing the ai tools cost as well so this is a good news for content creators who are creating lot of content using ais and this will change the world in future i would say definitely so start learning if you are not aware of prompt engineering then do comment in this comment section to create a full tutorial around prompt engineering and i will make sure i'll create it if you understood how to install deep seek its api features etc and you are loving it then please like the video and if you like chat gpt still then i would say to please comment on why you are still favoring chat gpt let's keep the discussion open and i will see you in the next video with much more details around deep seek some more use cases around deep seek i hope this video is informative to you all and i will see you in the next video thank you